a new Android Wear promises more interaction with the user interface. More rumors of the iPad Pro claim a launch date and order details. The Pebble Time steal is just a few weeks away. I'm Jaime Rivera, officially claiming that if it were up to me, you would all have to day off, including me, obviously. This is Pocket Now Daily. The official news today start with Microsoft, the company that's not everyone's cup of tea lately. The company obviously is under fire with the future of the Lumia lineup, and uh, the company's Terry Meyerson just came on record to confirm that we can expect high-end Lumias coming soon, and uh, the speculation claims that it could happen at IFA, and that we could probably see a launch happening on September 24. So set your clocks. Let's see if that's true. And for those of you that are still on the ropes about the Pebble Time, well, the Pebble Time steal is apparently just a couple of weeks away. The company has just confirmed that it will try to give uh, backers of the Pebble Time steal their unit as soon as the, the last week of July or early August. And they want to finish with backers that early for them to be able to sell the rest of the units to everyone else. So uh, tell us what you think. Will you consider a Pebble Time steal? Or how about the Pebble Time? In my case, I'd go for the regular Pebble Steel. Now, if you remember a couple of weeks ago, we covered that with the launch of iOS 9, we saw that there were new colors of iPods in the works, and we thought that the news ended there. But uh, some sources that we are still trying to confirm claim that uh, the new iPods are not just about new colors. It seems that the new iPod Touch is bringing a 64-bit processor, as it seems that Apple is not even ready to make these products die. Even cooler is that apparently these products will be silently launched tomorrow, so we'll report back tomorrow and see what happens. And even though the iPad lineup is on decline in addition to the rest of the world of tablets lately, it seems that uh, Apple is still uh, trying to give us their larger 12.9 inch iPad Pro or iPad Plus. And if you're wondering when this is going to happen, it seems that it will start selling in November. So the skepticism right now is if it will be announced in November or announced in October as it usually is, and for us to get the product sold in November. And uh, it seems that Apple will be cautious with the amount of orders as Apple usually does with new products. Uh, let's see if it sells in the end or if it revamps the iPad lineup as Apple wants it to. And finally, for the very interesting rumors of the day, it seems that Google is already working on a new version of Android Wear and we have leaked screenshots. Apparently, a couple of changes are coming. First of all, the way you interact with your friends. Uh, if you have uh, the current uh, way you could tap a friend on the Apple Watch and send your heartbeat, it seems that Google is working on something similar but better. And in addition to that, it seems that it's also working on more interactive watch phases. There's currently a walk around to do this, but Google wants to make this something from the operating system. Them. So now instead of going to look for cards for weather information or your steps, this will now be part of the watch phase, which is really cool. But it does lead me to the question of the day. Given the fact that Android Wear hasn't really sold well, what would you want Android Wear to do for you like it? In my case, honestly, I would like to be able to make phone calls with the watch or at least have the watch respond to me via voice because the current one-way interaction is sadly, I don't know, it feels archaic. But leave us a comment down below. What is your case? And friends, as always, you know the drill. If you want to get the news earlier before this video was filmed, make sure you follow us on PocketNow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera, and on Instagram at Jaime Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.